Hello everyone and welcome to stage 6 of the GeoGuessr to the France. Uh, before we begin, I am now using a higher res screen. Uh, let's see how this goes. Stuff will be smaller but I guess. So yeah, I guess. Anyways, uh, uh, into the stage. First, stage 5, the time trial from a few days ago in Marseille. Now we have the map of the stage. As you can see, it was all south of the city center. Uh, as on the most seven, eight, and nine, I believe, were the ones we got. Uh, and it didn't go as well as I'd hoped, at least not as good as uh, my performance in the time trial in the Gale of Italia, since we didn't actually have this route beforehand. Uh, it, we did get a really fast time on uh, this round here on Chemin du Corbelon, but as we'll see, we did not win that. Max FI got it in 44 seconds, 3 seconds faster than us, which is unfortunate. Uh, we had the round in front of the South Velo firm, which, yeah, I didn't know where that was. Uh, what the? Round three, okay, yeah, uh, that's fair enough. Eight seconds, that's really fast. I've needed further thirty-five seconds. That took us a long time to get. And last round was all the way out here, which I lost points on because I got on the bridge when we were not. Not the best stage, as we'll see. We didn't do too well. Seven fifty-four. All the way down here and unfortunately as this was the time trial round all the time delays will be doubled and what that means is we've dropped three spots uh we were 12th or 13th last week i believe uh and now we've dropped all the way into 15th it doesn't look like a lot but we'll see we have like a six minute gap to exit here with the next one up that's going to be an uphill battle to climb. I thought we'd be fighting for 11th spot with Miner and Ultra soon. But, alas, that's not the case. We have that, we didn't get any points or anything. It was the thing, there were no mountain stages. So anyways, today we have the stage. Now on to Port de Envalida uh, in Andorra. We're going to be going into another country today. Now we have a profile stage, and as always, we'll chart this out. That's not perfect. Here we go. So the first end is Narbon, which is here, from here, and uh, put on the there. Oh, it's past El Bas, the Bas, and it was a little weird. Like, I, I, I can never tell whether. Uh, the words are French or Pan or uh, Catalonia, really. Uh, but yeah, this entire area is the Catalonian speaking part of France, I believe. Uh, I do know. Oh, uh, oh just going past the area. Interesting little place here. Uh, but yeah, so we have a 201 kilometer route, this is 200. We don't have any other tips over here. Uh, first part of the stage is flat and then there's an ascent. But um, this route probably makes sense. We've got the right distance. There could be some other routes around here. Maybe if it went all the way north, like here, 204. Yeah, there's equivalent ones, but we. We did see that, yeah, 
we did see that there's only climbs near the end, so this would make sense where we enter the Pyrenees later on in the stage. Uh, the yeah, so the other thing is it's Catalan. I know some Spanish, so I think like if we see signs, I might be able to understand some of it. Uh, I don't know if that's going to help or not. I mean, usually our best friends are the just highway signs and stuff. But if I do see a sign in Catalan, maybe I'll understand some of it. We'll see. Uh, so yeah, we have to stay here. We can look at some of the main roads. Actually, now that I've looked at this, the issue is that there's... I don't think we'll be following roads as large as the N... Like, N-series roads that we do avoid highways. Where we get a similar route. But 200 kilometers, so it might be fine. We might go near Perpignan. I don't know. Uh, we have both port la nouvelle Prade, Beaucaire. if we see clients we give you that that might show up since it's like to be in a different country and we put on valida if you look at the rest of the information for the stage we have three climbs a first category second category and third category now looking at the stage we are almost definitely going to have the three climbs in this area i don't think that could count as a mountain stage so we're looking at stuff maybe around Prades or uh, Boker, and possibly actually now that i think about it i think the first category mountain stage will be over here on the end three Twenty near both Poimodas, Poimodo, I think. I don't know how you pronounce that. Well, uh, something like that. I don't think we'd be approaching Andrew from the north. I think this is the approach into Andrew we we'll take. So yeah, I, I think the mountain stage will be somewhere here, a big catalyst, something like that. Anyways, uh, enough chatting. Oh, we also know sprint is on the second round. So the first round is just going to be a regular round, and then after that, we're fighting for points. Let's do this. Got stage six. Okay. I'm just going to, yeah. Let's do this. Start. Okay, so we have a flat area. Let's go this way. Do you have a road number? No, you do not. Must be that so far. That's the thing. I, I can't tell whether that's French or Catalan or what? So this is definitely on the stretch towards, like, towards Narbon. Okay, we have this. So D six double O nine to Perpignan. Uh, the Basalt Chateau, South Le Chateau. D6009, there we go. I think this is a long one, yeah. So we've looked at, uh, Fito is here. Uh, Fito Solstice. Uh, so, Deep Solstice is there. Okay, so we're north, this somewhere. Go back to the star. Okay, Mullah, ah, boy. Something. That's off to the east. This is not smooth. Camping PC mobile. Okay. 
to be near the beach. Uh, uh, actually, no. The scene is no. That should be swimming pool, I think. Which isn't exactly that so. We are on not out stretch, but we'll probably need another major road nearby. Uh, okay, we have water directly to the east. So, yeah, I think we're on this stretch then. Lakaban, the people. And this stretch of road goes pretty much directly north south. We could be in this area. Pumping the fun. Mulan of oh, wait. There we go. And yeah, this will be it. 5k. Was a bit slow, but I want to get the 5k. Uh, I, I don't think I could see the water from the starting location. But it's a good thing I found. I could probably put them in faster finding Fitta or the salt and salt the chateau, but yeah, we have the 5k. I'm not mad. Next, this should be the sprint if it wants to load in N116 Rad Rade and Il Sultet N116 Rad to the west Il Sultet is there and we need the third road cut not gonna load in no the e13 d so in g probably right in that somewhere yeah 11 meters okay yeah, but we are not getting points on that. Uh, I, and anyone who turned the other way and saw the first sign would have a better time, essentially. Uh, and it doesn't help that it's taking a minute for stuff to load, but I'm not complaining. Uh, that, that wasn't too bad. Uh, yeah. Okay, so now come all the mountain stages, right? Three, four, five. Uh, the last one should be the main one, and the first two are second category ones, which means they should be fairly hard, I think, or at least fairly tall mountain type of climbing. Let's see. So I can run a straight stretch of road. We get anything off these sticks. No, we do not. I think they're just snow markers or something. No sticks. Not that I would know. Okay. I think. I think I'm okay. Is. Oh, would you like to lower it? I saw something yellow. I'm almost not worried about time anymore. I just want to get a perfect score, which might be easier said than done. But we have some signs here. I'm trying to think. Could we be. Actually, I don't think we're on the Andorra side just because. The areas we're going to be going in Andorra are quote unquote urban by Andorra standards, I guess. And it's fairly well signed since it's such a small country, the density, I guess, of signs would be more. So I would say we're on the France side, unless that is. Something 
font for this, which I don't recognize. I don't know whether maybe we had better uh, clues up the hill slash mountain. I guess it's more of a mountain, isn't it? Okay. D28. We're definitely in like this area in the Pyrenees. So. Uh, France, okay, this uh, four pixels. One is it D28? Yes, D28. We're over here right now. We came from the south somewhere. We're on the section of the road that goes there. We might be here. We have a bit of a road that angle might not be quite right this makes more sense there's a small curve and it starts going pretty much directly east yeah that would check out and the last thing to check over here it curves and goes almost north and then goes back around so i think we have that 5k there we go Took longer than it should have. I let is there anything the other way? You'd find that, but that's not a numbered road. So I think this might have been the closest hint. It's just a matter of who got there quick, I guess. Uh anyways, we'll see how we did. It's possible maybe someone actually that this Pong Pong to get clear? I don't know. That might have been further away, so yeah, curving back on yourself. Uh, maybe I could have gone further. I think I stopped in between. Yeah, over here to check out that sign, but um, that went well, I guess. We're not good at the mountain round, so that went well. Considering, okay, this is also a second category. If we look around. I'm gonna go this way. There's no clear up and down at this point. I don't think those had road numbers. The snow sticks are similar, so I think we might be in that kind of area. This is a train line. That's something to look out for. It's to the east of our star, I think. Yeah, to the east. So that will help. Uh, so sort of narrow down the location once we got it. There's a riverbed. The river itself is non-existent. Uh, still in these now. Oh, there. Flew past just the kilometer down. Kobasil something. Here we go. N20. It shouldn't be hard to spot the N20 that's here. Question is where on the N20 are we? We can actually look for the train line. This is the Tunnel on the N20, that's definitely not where we are. N20 goes here, we have a train line. Where does the train line cross the N20? That's about here. We have a river. That checks the rest of the Actually, now that I think about it, okay. Where we started, the rail line is to the east of the and 20 so we started down here somewhere uh yeah and i think that is what we saw we're somewhere on this stretch 
uh there's a road going to the south and we have this so i think we're about here yep yeah uh yeah uh, i saw the crossing over here but it didn't seem quite right because it's not really east of the starting location uh but yeah over here we had like the road going off to the side and this like fairly distinctive bend in the road which helped so yeah that's four rounds and now we have the last one which i'm now a bit confused as to where it could be um actually yeah it, it might still be in if my map was load. yeah it could be like up here in Perth or my law uh something like that uh we've had a location there this wouldn't be a stage one mountain near uvia uh we have a four foot roof um that's one actually we could have this this would make sense for something lambertage this would make sense for a stage uh, uh for category one line where we yeah, we sort of go around Evia from here. So, um, yeah. Uh, so we'll want to look, we'll be either on the D618 up here or on the N320 over here. So, uh, actually, I'm going to check one thing. Does it show up as a divided highway on the map? It does not. Okay. Let's see. If we have Port Palmeron, that's there. If we have, like, Bolke, or Ekat, or Tagason, or Lemitar, something like that, then we'll be up here. It also makes sense if we have all these T lines, but last round, here we go. Okay, straight south, west, north, east. There's a gas station to the south. Circuit snow driving. This one stopped there. Big capture sign. I can pick my uh. Oh, Tom Valida. Okay. So it's literally at the end. PG2 for Tom Valida. Yeah, we have the total and stuff back there. Back to the start. I, I actually, I didn't realize what Tom Valida was like a mountain top. We have this. We have. The building up there, I think we're here. Yep, 5k. I wasn't 100% sure on that actually, but I went for it. Now, if you look at how we did, overall 11.25, we have 10.25, 7, 10, 5.21, okay. And what is the delay on this? Three times, so we're safe on that end, but this is still a slow time compared to who Hesh means so, which I mean makes sense they're French I believe uh yeah looking at the rest of it first round we were nowhere near the top times second round again not really uh second round was the sprint right only top three so yeah we're nowhere near that we have 23 30, 37, that's already out of it. There's two 37s in fact, and a 33. So, yeah, we weren't close to that. Round three, uh, I can see people faster than me, unfortunately. Same at round four, we have a minute 42, minute 
22, 30, 36 seconds, oh my goodness. Uh, and max if I, again, it's out by a few seconds, but not that it would matter on that one. Here, again, we're too slow. Uh, only top few get it, we're out of that as well. Yeah, 51 seconds, my goodness. But yeah, we'll see um, next time for stage 7. Anyways, thank you all very much for watching. And yeah, I'll see you then. Goodbye.